Hello everybody, this is Mon Retro Gamer, and welcome to Let's Play Fantasy Star 4. In the last episode, we went through the Courage and Strength Towers on Rykros and defeated their bosses. Uh, gaining the Rings of the Stars, we returned to Laroof to discover the real reason behind Dark Force and the reason why the Algo Solar System is threatened every thousand years. We've, we are the Protectors, and we are supposed to end Dark Force's original form, the Profound Darkness. Chaz isn't so happy with that, however, because we are effectively dancing to the Great Lights tune, much like Zeo was to the Profound Darkness. But Rune says he has a plan, or at the very least, that we'll find something we're looking for at the Esper Mansion. So here we are. Let's see what it's all about. So you're a friend of Kyra. Please come in. I'm sorry, what? Why? Uh, is it this? Um, what a gentle-looking face this statue of a woman has. Um, no. I'd say... Okay, what do we do? Rune. What on earth are you saying is in the Esper Mansion? Just be quiet and follow me. Well, given the fact that Rune knows about it, it's probably Lutz's thing, so we'll head back to Lutz's room. Um, which... it's only probably been about... No, it's been a fair while since we've been to Lutz's room. I'll give you that much. Um, so we're going to head to Lutz's room. And hopefully here we're going to find something. Secret room. Cool. Jazz, the sacred sword Elsidian awaits you. The sacred sword Elsidian? It's probably the one and only weapon that has the power to destroy the profound darkness. Go, Jazz, alone. Go and meet with Elsidian. Meet Elsidian? That's right, and at that time you should find the answer you are looking for. Uh, well, what you need to do is you need to unequip the Guardian Sword. Uh, you need to head in completely barehanded. Okay, I didn't know I was going to get attacked. Uh, I'm going to put back on the Guardian Sword. Okay? Yeah. Take that. Darn phantoms. Take that. A thousand Mazetta for, for for no reason. Um come on, come on, come on, come on. Up. Okay, now we take off the Guardian Sword. Ugh. Whoa. So this is the sacred sword. Elsidian. What? I hear a voice from somewhere. Ah, you have made it, Chaz Ashley. This is the place where the spirits of those who fought to protect Algo return to. Elsidian is the sword sheltered by those spirits. Now, Chaz, you must take Elsidian in your hands. Oh yeah! What? Hey! Oh wow, it's people from past games. Fantasy Star? Fantasy Star 2? Nay. She looks a lot like Rika. Wow. <laughs> Supposed to be Fantasy Star 3, but that's in Newman. Alice. So you are Chaz, whom Rune selected. You were able to understand. Ah! Chaz, I entrust to you the care of Elsidian. All of our thoughts are stored within that sword. We will all be with you, Chaz. Always. So, don't worry. Leave it to me.
<laughs> wow. I knew it. El Sidian promised that it would give you power. There was no mistake in my judgment. Rune. Jazz, let's go save Algo. Right. We're doing it for all life in Algo, and to create a future that is truly free of terror. A future unbound at last from the evil of the past. For that, I will fight. Chaz. Let's conquer, Chaz. For Algo! We have an emergency. Demi informs us that disaster has erupted on Matavia. Chaz! Alright, let's hurry to Matavia. Oh, that that's almost never good. Let's see how good El Sidian is. Uh, in comparison to the Guardian Sword, it increases our attack and defense a little bit. But it's also a holy weapon, which does extra damage to quite a few things, honestly. Uh, such as bosses. Now we need to head back to Tyler. Uh, and we need to... Oh, they're walking straight. Ah, you made it, Chaz! Raja, are you okay now? And Kyra, you're here too! A minor sickness like that couldn't keep me in bed. Take me with you. There's reassurance in numbers. Since I'm so reliable, I'll accompany you. Raja and Kyra, thank you. Looks like we're heading to Matavia. Uh, I wasn't planning to, but okay. Han! Grizz! And Demi, too! Hey, Chaz. You seem to have become stronger since we last met. I was scolded by Pana, but I came anyway. The system is finally stabilized. Now I can go with you. Everybody, everybody, thank you so much. Demi, what is this disaster you reported? Well, a large hole suddenly opened north of Piata. The life forms around that hole are dying, one after the other. But there's no gas or radiation emissions coming from the hole. There's no need to verify it. We knew as soon as we arrived in Matavia. It's all due to the black energy wave, and a pretty strong one at that. It's a profound darkness. He finally opened the door from the other dimension. Jazz, let's go! Isn't this the final battle? Really, you guys need taken care of. I'll be your big sister and look after you. Well, seeing that we're all here, I'd like all of you to go, but there are only five there are only five rings of stars to protect us from the power of the darkness. So that means we have to choose one person to take. Oh man, this is a big choice. Um but what I'm gonna be doing is Actually, I'm heading to Rykros uh, right now, because there's another power boost we can get up in Rykros. Um, yeah. I'll tell you, the game's picking up pace. It's only been, like, what, three episodes since we first landed on Rykros? Three, four episodes since we landed on Rykros? I'm just, wow. But... I believe somewhere to the right, I think? Somewhere to the right, I'm pretty sure. There is a... Ah, Kula Beller. Darn it, Kula Beller. Lightning Breath, of course, and they use it on the one person who's weak to lightning. Oh my god, it's got a holy version of the Genesee Claw! Oh yes! Yes! But anyway, there should be some kind of... There should be some kind of secret passage along here that uh, will enable us to get a certain thingamagummy that is actually quite useful for the road ahead. So I want to find it. Uh but it doesn't appear to be sticking out like a sore thumb or anything. So, uh, I may actually have to... Huh. 
Alright, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to pause until I find it. So I'll see you guys in a few seconds. Oh, hang on. It's actually just a passage left from the Courage Tower. That's it. The Anger Tower. El Sidian is shining. A voice is reverberating in my head. Oh, protectors of Algo, the Anger Tower welcomes you gladly. That almost never sounds good. Uh, so we've got more equipment. That's that's nice. What is it? It's a Saldu, of course. Because who doesn't love Saldus? Get rid of the Laco Claw. Uh, blood savers and dark witches. This is the Anger Tower, and this is just a kind of thing for Chaz, uh, unless we find some kind of more equipment, like a second Guardian Mail. That would, that would be quite nice to have you know, a second Guardian Mail, so that Rika and Chaz could be equally well equipped. But, uh, in all likelihood, is that going to be here? Mmm, I'd say no. But we need to fight anyway. So might as well do some digging, you know? Come on, we can take them. Mm. Attack the hawk and left. Hack and left. So, what now? There's a... Oh, there's a chest. We have to we have to look in the chest. We we, we 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 just have to look in the chest. I don't care what anyone says, we have to look in the chest. Understand? Do you understand me right now? We have to look in the chest. Chaz leveled up. That's always good. Uh, <laughs> Come on. We have to go back around. That's that, that's annoying. But at the very least, it looks like that actual side of the place only goes up one floor, so it shouldn't last too long. Just come on, really? I started moving without uh, unpausing the recording. Uh, anyway, kill. Kill him. Good, good, very good. So, we just need to head around here. Come on, guys. Illusionist and Kermit. Krim, Kermit heads. Kermit. Kermit heads? I don't know. But we're taking out all the demony things with El Sidian, so, you know, I'm glad of, I'm glad of El Sidian. I always thought it was pronounced Elistolion, but uh, the L comes before the S, so it's obviously Elsidian. Uh, or Elsidion. I'm just gonna say Elsidian, because. Who's here to stop me? Nobody. It's probably the wrong pronunciation. But do I care? No. And everyone's getting fairly high leveled. We're all in the mid 40s at this point, I'd say. Uh, it's a guard mail! A guard mail. Totally called this. Get rid of the Lacco mail. Guardian mail is procured for Rika. Rika now has 169 defense. That's pretty good, but nowhere near as good as Chaz. And now we are going to go into the Anger Tower proper. Come on, guys. Hack and left. Hack and left. Skadoosh, skadoosh. Ow. Skapoosh. There, now we can take them out with impunity. Now, if Rune had taken that one out, that would have been awkward for it, honestly. Guys! 
Guys! Stop it! Acid breath. Acid breath. Still does effectively nothing. Because, you know, just that good. Just that good of an armor. Uh, the Guardian stuff obviously is very acid proof. Uh, honed from the sweat and blood and tears of many warriors before us. Uh, blood sabers and dark witches. Uh, may have accidentally spilled some blood on it in the past, but. What? An instant death attack worked? It. It. It worked? They. They don't work. They fail. Horribly. Now we have to revive Chaz outside of the battle. Ah, oh, my word, this is just wasting so much time. Rika. I'm sure now as Chaz, while you're at it. Uh, you yourself can probably still take a hit. Oh, no. Die. Do you mind? I'm trying to kill your friend. Skadoosh. Thank you, and Giwat on Ren really doesn't do much. Uh, Skaboosh. And down, and we got a Laconian Rod, but we don't need it. No, we're not going to give up the Laconian Rod, actually. Uh, what can we get rid of? Do we need the Pulse Falcon at this point? Uh, I want to keep it, just in case. Guardian Shield. Uh, Genocide Claw, obviously. The one thing we don't need... I'd say it's the Laconian Crown that's going to be the least helpful. Ren leveled up. Good. Now. Uh, is Chaz... Yep. What? I'm sorry. What? Alice? Alice Brangwyn, the eight-stroke warrior. Our mentor and mother figure. You're dead! Who the hell are you? What? Alice! You're here on Rykros? Alice? Alice! Hey, answer me, Alice! Yikes! Alice? Alice, I don't want to hurt you, but you're actually hurting me quite a lot. But I won. Alice. Alice! <laughs> Who's that? It's another guardian. Well, well, Protector. What a weakling you are. So you wail and lament for something you know to be an illusion. An illusion? Is that right? You... You... Ah, your anger. Your hatred. It's quite a show of your force of character. Would you like to be able to wholly transform those feelings into strength? Huh? As a technique to transform emotions of anger and hatred into powers of destruction. Do you want to know about it? No. No way, that's... that's... that's way above my pay grade, man. Don't mess with me! Huh. <laughs> Why is that? Even if I won using such a power, it would be meaningless. It would only make us the same as the darkness. I see. You fought the illusion, and yet you haven't lost sight of yourself. All right, I shall trust you with the technique. The forbidden technique. Medjid. Medjid? The forbidden technique? There's nothing to be afraid of. It's necessary to feel anger and hatred for humans to be... human. Oh. There shouldn't be any danger that you will be corrupted by the power of Medjid. Just don't forget your true self. 
Okay, I think we just... Mumble. What? Where is this? Where is everybody? Okay. Uh, mumble. I, I like how it changed to, to mumble, because we are on our own. Um, but we now know Medjid, which is an incredibly powerful spell. Uh, and everyone's back. And now we Heinous. And we Ryuka to the Silence Temple. Actually, where do we get back on the ship? It's up, it's through that door, isn't it? It's through this door. Yep. Uh, head to Motavia. And uh, I suppose this is going to be end yet, the end of the episode. So we've gotten the legendary sword El Sidian, uh, and with it the spirits of all the heroes of all the previous Fantasy Star games. All three of them. Um, and we also gained the Forbidden Technique Medjid. So next time on Let's Play Fantasy Star 4, we are picking one of these lucky five contestants to figure out who's going to be facing the ultimate embodiment of evil itself. What a prize. This is Mon Retro Gamer. See you guys next time. Alice would have been standing right here. <laughs>